so before uploading the product if i just share with you the design here you can see the product variants which is color size and other variants you can add here and uh, it's a good practice to add the variants before uploading the product and also add the categories so before creating any shop if you have all the list of categories list of product variants you should add them first to do so i'm going to go to all products there is no product here let's create categories first the first one is uncategorized let's create man there will be one category and the thumbnail that i'm going to upload here let's upload the category thumbnail from here here is the category thumbnail there will be three categories in this project let's upload here and this one is man category and add here so i i have zoom in my screen for a long or bigger space so if i just zoom 90 percent, it looks perfect here and i have added the main category let's add women and the second one is uh, sorry there is another one let's navigate here women and men and women discount so there will be men and women discount so women and here should be this one click add new and there's another one discount click here this one so i didn't i'm not going to add the alternative text every single time and i'm not going to show you every single time the alternative text here for the image but it's a good practice you have to add them now let's click attributes to add some attributes here let's say color and if you want to enable archive so you can enable it from here but i'm not going to use archive as of now click attributes color and then size so i'm going to use color and size for this project uh, if you want to add any kind of value here uh, like the type or any kind of things you can add them but for the color black orange and white color let's change the color attributes and terms basically it's called terms add the terms white black and orange so these are three color variant that i have added let's go back to our size add excel l and let's take a look at our design m and s m and s so that's the size variant and if i click attributes again you can see the terms are visible here so we have added our attributes and category let's add a simple product here go to all products there is no product you can create click here create product or you can click add product here let's type here product one add some short descriptions for the uh, dummy text i'll be using lipsum.com click generate let's copy the text from here paste it here select product image let's upload product image here so this one is product one let's select product one and also add gallery image 
So I'll be using these images as a gallery image. All of them are I'll be using similar as of now. And the regular price, it's displaying a currency which is not USD, it's displaying the currency uh, Bangladesh, uh, Bangladesh Taka. So let's add a price 30 and I'll be changing the currency. It's a simple product. I'm not going to add nothing here. And you can sell uh, add a discount or sell price 25 Taka. So that's it. Click publish. Now if I visit our sh shop page here, it will display one product here. It looks like this. We will be customizing them later on, but it looks like this. It looks great already, right? But there are a couple of things we'll be adding later on. So here you can see the customize uh, category. I didn't add the category yet. Let's add the category to women, men and women discount. Click update. So we have added one product here. Let's add another product. So I'm going to add a new tab here. Let's add product two. Short descriptions I have copied already. Add a price, let's say 340, sell price 200, 200. I don't know why it's not clicking. Well, and it should be a variable product. So this is the variable product. Let's add the price. I should have changed it. It says KU and you can add it or you can leave it and you can use manage quantity. I have in-depth tutorial. Make sure you have completed them. So let's click on attributes. Let's click color. I have already selected the color orange, black, white color. Uh, used for variants. Make sure you have checked here save attributes again select size i would like to add size here let's change or add the size available size you can add size here from attributes or you can add a new size from here as well save use for variants well now click save attributes it's save and click variant variations click here create variations from all attributes then click go click ok and 12 variations added here so there is a black color l black m black s black xl here you can see the 12 variations do not have prices variations and their attributes that do not have prices uh, will not be shown in your store so if i click add price so add price to all variations that don't have price let's say 30 at price so if i click over here as you can see it adds price 30 if i click all of them it adds the price 30 but you can change them so for an example if i select the black which is l and i can change the image for black let's change it to this one and I can change the sale price as well. Let's change it 20. And here is black again. You can change the image for M. Let's change it. So I'm, I'm going to show you only this product here. So I'm not going to show you every single product with attributes, but I'll be adding few products here. So this is the image for black. Let's add image few of them are for image for orange let's add this one so there is another one which is white color I'll be adding them so click here white color and white here as well then this one it takes a lot of time right <laughs> so I'm, I'm not i could change the 
duration or cut this from the video but i think you should watch them and let's add product image here so the product to this one and add a gallery add some image here for product gallery use men women and women discount men and women discount and here there is uh, nothing to worry about and change here uh, okay click publish and view the product here it looks like this so when i change black the color and when i change the size l it's displaying the black color that we have selected from our uh, editor if i change m it's still displaying the black one but if i change orange it will display the orange image if i change it to white color it's displaying the white image and it's out of stock because i didn't add or manage the stock quantity there let's add l it's out of stock so you have to manage the stock here so the stock quantity is, is zero here if i uncheck and update it will be displaying here so please again i have said a couple of times if you do not understand how things work here how it works so you can manage the stock individually from here as well so if they are not visible you can simply always navigate here let's block and l let's make it manage stock and a stock quantity let, let's make it 10 and here you can see block l it has 10 stock right it's working so what i was saying that uh, if you do not understand uh, there are lots of things lots of things are here and if i want to explain you everything in this video it will take a lot of time so except i ha i have suggest you i'd like to suggest you watch this video completely from beginning uh, it it's uh, it has everything i have shared here so let's close the ad and uh, you can learn every single options from here i highly recommend you to complete this one if you if you want to make yourself as a uh, WooCommerce expert. Now we have added our variable products and the style will be changing later on step by step and add some other products very quickly. So we have added our five products here we'll be adding more products later on based on our preference so as of now the shop page looks like this so we just completed if i click all products here we have added these five products so i'll be discussing more about the products i'll be adding more different variants product later on uh, based on the time when we'll be designing the website so as of now that's enough for designing our home page now let's navigate here okay i'm sorry 
so now uh, let's design our next section which is popular t-shirt 